previously on The Walking Dead. You don't have to fill his cup up anymore, baby. Grandpa is sleeping. No, Yaya. Dipo's awake. Solamente está confundido. Mama! Oh my god! Oh my god! Hey! Put your hands up and close your eyes. Thanks. Mari! Oh, shit! Kate! Javi, don't! Hey, what do we call you? Sorry, forgot to introduce myself. It's Paul, but my friends call me Jesus. I fucking knew it. You're one of them? You're goddamn right she is. If you want to shoot me, shoot me. How about I shoot your little boyfriend here instead? Holy shit! What the hell's going on out here? Oh my god. So close to dark. It's harder to see them coming. We're just gonna get that propane and then come right back. I, I saw it in that pickup truck parked down the road a little. In front of the Wallace's house. I just wish there was an easier way to get it. And that we didn't have to risk life and limb every damn day for food and water and gas for the stove. Oh, am I babbling? I babble when I'm scared. I can do this myself, you know. Not too late for you to turn around. Who's gonna watch your back if I'm not here? Besides, I can't just hole up in this house forever. I need... I need to get used to being out here. Okay. If we're lucky, we won't see a single one of those things. <sighs> Fingers crossed. There it is! Let's take it and go. <sighs> Empty. You've got to be fucking kidding me! God damn it! <sighs> of course it's empty. Why would we get that lucky? I mean, it's not like we needed it or anything. Hey, keep it down. I know it sucks, Kate, but you gotta watch out. I'm sorry. I'm just sick of this shit. I just thought this one time we deserve to catch a fucking break. Friends. True. He was so sweet. He 
always had a smile on his face. Cape worshipped him. That's not true anymore. I know, it, it still looks like him, but... The kid you knew, he's gone. All that's left is this... thing. I don't even know what to call them. If they're not people, if they're just the dead... <sighs> Muertos. That's what we'll call them. I thought we were gonna die. I thought Gabe and Mariana were just gonna wake up and we would just be gone. When it was on you? Oh my god. We should, uh, really get back inside. Yeah. Okay. I know we all wanted to stay here in the house and wait for David to come back, but it's been three months since he drove away with your mom. What are you saying? We're not safe here. Not anymore. You and I could have been killed out there for an empty can. There's got to be a safer place out there. Somewhere not so isolated. What makes you think it's going to be better anywhere else? Everything and everyone outside this door is dead. Exactly. How long until one of those things gets in? We stay. Somebody's going to get hurt. Or worse. You really think the kids are going to be happy with this plan? The kids will understand. A and if they don't, we'll just make them see it our way. We have to go. How come? What if I don't want to leave? Cabe. We're safe inside the house. A and I bet we can... Find more food in the neighborhood if we just look harder. We're tired of being afraid every time we leave you guys alone. And it's just getting worse out there. Better to leave now, while we still can. But what about Dad? What's he gonna think if he shows up and we, we just ditched him? We might never find him again. Your dad would want us to do this game. He'd want us to survive. We've been surviving. Here! At home! Barely. I'm sorry, Gabe, but... Javi's right. Uh, how about you guys go and I stay here? You're a kid. That's not how it works. I can take care of myself. If I need any help, I'll just ask my friends. Gabe? Honey? What? What's, what's wrong with her? Why is she acting so weird? Uncle Javi? She's sad. Because when we were out, we saw your friend, Drew. But it wasn't exactly him anymore. You mean, he, he was one of them? We're so sorry, Gabe. So you understand why, don't you? Why we have to leave? If that happened to you, I couldn't bear it. When do we have to go? Tomorrow, as soon as it's daylight. I want to leave him a note. I'll help you get started, okay? What are we gonna tell him? I want to say something good. Something that won't make him sad. Just tell him we love him. All of us. And nothing's gonna change that. Not ever. I like that. I'm gonna write it right now, so we don't forget. Of course. I'll help him. Thank you. Really.
Dad? Javi! Is that really you? <laughs> I always hoped I'd find you. Never really thought it happened. Not after all this time. God, you have no idea how good it is to see your face. I think I got a pretty decent idea, actually. I knew you were still alive. I knew it! Hey, weapons down! This is my family! You gotta let us in. Kate doesn't have much longer. Jesus. Kate! David? I'm here, honey. I'm right here. What the hell happened? She's been shot. And we got the bullet out, but she's still bleeding. We need your doctor. Now, David. Thanks, Javi. For getting her here. She's coming inside! But she hasn't been checked! This is my wife, Max. You want her to die? No! I didn't say that! Our doctor's gonna help you, honey. I'm gonna make sure of it. Wait, I I'm going with you. Sorry, but the rest of you have to go straight to quarantine. What for? All newcomers get checked for bites, and they all have to answer a couple of questions. Our doctor will clear the two of them, but the rest of you have to come with me to the quarantine holding area. It's how we keep it safe for everyone. Fine. Let's just get this over with. Hobby. Make my job easy, would you? Listen to your friend. <sighs> Whatever you say. Let's go. Trip. Oh, God, Eleanor. When we found the car without you in it. I didn't know what to think. The engine up and died. I came here looking for help, and this happened. I've been so worried about Kate. I told them she needed a doctor. They promised me someone would look into it. Please, tell me they found her. Well, luckily we found her before she got any worse. They just took her to the hospital. I can't believe no one went to look for her. I'm sorry, Javi. Really, but I didn't have any reason not to believe them. What? The people here in Richmond, their new frontier. Oh my god. Oh, ho, ho, you ain't even heard the worst part yet. One of them's his brother. I didn't even know you had a brother, Javi. Hey, nobody's more surprised than me. I, I thought the guy was dead. We haven't seen David in years. It's just been me, Kate, and the kids this whole time. I don't even want to think about what the odds are, but he did seem pretty damn surprised to see you. Whoever this guy is, he can't be all bad, right? I mean, he helped Kate instead of hauling her down here. Of course he brought her inside. She's his damn wife. You're kidding. Kate is married to your brother? The way you two acted around each other. I just didn't think she had a husband out there, is all. The only reason I know Kate is because she married David. I was the best man at their wedding. Wow. Okay. Family drama aside, hope you know I'm not about to make nice with New Frontier. I know you didn't have much stake in Prescott, Javi, but they burned that place to the ground for no fucking reason. After everything you folks told me, I'm guessing I'm not gonna find my people alive. Hell, Javi. They killed your niece! Shot Kate! For all we know, your brother could have been behind it. And even if it wasn't his idea in the first place, if he knew about it and didn't stop it, that shit can't stand. No fucking way David was a part of that. That's not the kind of man he is. Maybe he wasn't the last time you saw him, but you said yourself, it's been a while. 
What was he like when you knew? You guys get along? He seemed happy enough to see you up there. At least at first. Things between me and him were complicated. Some days we'd be at each other's throats. Other days we could shoot the shit for hours and still find stuff to talk about. So he's a moody son of a bitch, huh? If your brother knew anything about what happened in Prescott, he's got to answer for it. They all do. I owe that to Conrad. I'm not just going to let things slide. I've never really been an eye for eye kind of man. But people died. We need to even out the scales. We need to look like we're playing along with their rules. Go along with what they say. For now. Then, when the time is right, that's when we demand justice. Hey. Hey. I would have been here sooner, but I had to take care of... something. Come on already, Kate's asking for you. Maybe you think it's okay to keep a lady waiting. Thought I taught you better than that. What about the rest of my friends? They're not invited. Hurry up now. Looks like the rules don't apply to everyone, huh? That's right. Some people get out of here early. Others stay a long fucking time. Trip. Just drop it, okay? Smart cookie, this one. Javi, just go. I'll be back as soon as I can. You know that. Thanks. along with them for now? That doesn't sound good. We have a process. Our own way of doing things. Your guys better not have a problem with that. Things don't go well for troublemakers here. I hope that's clear. David, you threw us in a cell. Don't expect us to smile about it. We do that to protect our people. It's not personal. You sure about that? Come on. Where are we going? Kate asked for you. I thought you'd want to check on her. Listen, Javi, Gabe... He told me some pretty messed up things. Things I need your help wrapping my head around. He shouldn't have done that. I wanted to tell you myself. Bad news is bad news. Who cares who delivers it? He told me you lost Mariana. Just a few days ago. Oh. I'm sorry, David. She's... She's gone. It's strange grieving for the same person twice. Like losing something you didn't know you had. What was she like, Javi? She was so little when we got separated. Who did my little girl become? Mariana saw things that other people didn't. She, uh... She told me she wanted to write down her memories to keep them alive after she was gone. Sounds like her. Always was a dreamer. How? How did she die? Tell me how it happened. Please, I need to know. She was just standing there, minding her own business. She just found her lost headphones in the dirt. She was smiling. And then someone put a bullet in her head. What kind of animal would just open fire on her like that? An animal with your mark. 
My people aren't in the habit of killing little girls. David, I was there. They shot Kate, too. Ask your buddy at the gate if you don't believe me. Max was a part of this? Fuck. I need details. What the hell went down out there? I need to know exactly what happened. Everything you remember. Same assholes killed a hostage at this town, Prescott. Prescott? At the airstrip? Their leader flooded it with walkers and, and tear gas. Leader? A crazy bald guy with a beard. Badger, what the fuck have you done now? I'm gonna handle that stupid son of a bitch, okay? Do me a favor, keep this to yourself. The politics here, they can get messy. I thought you were the boss. There's four of us that run, Richmond. You need to impress the other three. Or you'll be back on the road by morning. Try not to stir things up. You and your friends could have a very short stay. You wouldn't let that happen, would you? We only just got here. It's not just up to me. I run security here, but it's not like my word is law. This shit with Badger doesn't make things any easier. Who's the fresh meat? Ava is my brother, Javi. The baseball brother? <laughs> no shit. What are the chances of you turning up on the doorstep? Welcome to civilization. Or at least the closest thing to it these days. It's a pleasure to meet you, Ava. Oh, is it now? <laughs> you didn't say he was a gentleman, David. That's because he's not. Ava's my right hand. If there's anyone you can trust in Richmond, it's her. That woman, the fucking soldier. She was the first person I met up with after you and me got separated. I never would have made it without her. Gabe said you went back to the house. At the start. I'm sorry I never found you. We waited for you. For three months. Eventually the house was overrun and we had to move. Why didn't you come back? Mama and I got routed out of the city on the way to the hospital. It wasn't long before she... Poor Mama. I couldn't get back into Baltimore, so I hooked up with my old unit. We thought we could build a safe zone outside D.C. After what happened to Mama and everyone else, I thought you were all dead. But you were taking care of them, weren't you? Somehow you found a way. I'm not gonna lie. I never thought you had it in you. We took care of each other. And we all had each other's backs. You've changed, brother. It took the end of the world. But you finally grew up. This is where they're treating Kate. Don't get comfortable. We're not staying long. Hey, kid. Got everything you need? Uh, yeah. This place is like a resort. Check it out, Javi. Noodles in a cup. We need to get you some real food. Stat. Turn you into a soldier. <laughs> Javi. I'm glad you're okay. <laughs> get off me! <laughs> Come on, Dad! You know me. I'm always okay. Damn, it's good to have you back. Look at this family. Look at my wife. Isn't she the most beautiful woman alive? Come on. With the lights off, you could mistake me for a walker. A damn fine walker. Gross. You're a lucky man, David. We're all lucky. Uh, what, you okay? Uh, my... <gasps> 
Shit. I'll get the duck. I'm fine. I just needed to talk to you, alone. I'm scared, Javi, more than I was the whole time on the road. Even when I thought I was going to die, everything inside me screams to get away from here. These people are killers. And David? David threw his own brother in a cell. Let's just get you better, Kate. The facilities here- I don't care about facilities. We did fine without them before. You didn't have a ruptured spleen before. These people nearly killed me, Javi. David's people. Have you forgotten, Mari? Of course not. It's always been you and me on the road, Javi. That's how we've made it this far. Please, promise me we'll go back to that. The first chance we get. This place. It's a cage. We can't let ourselves get locked in. It's going to get bad if we stay. I hear you, Kate. But we can't just turn our backs on this place. On my brother. Javi. We have to try to make it work. I used to say that about my fucked up marriage. Guess it still applies. Whatever. Just please. Please don't leave me alone for too long. Feeling better? How you doing, sweetheart? David reported some pain. It's less now. Strange how it just comes and goes. Doesn't seem normal. She was rambling a bit. Yeah, I think she's delirious. Well, she seems cogent now. But it's nothing to be alarmed about. Pain often comes in waves with abdominal wounds. <laughs> I'll give you something to take the edge off, in case it comes back. Truly superlative work. I thought I'd have to operate, but all she needed was IV fluids and some antibiotics. How did you find someone with skills like these? A wound like this kills nine out of ten. Whoever did this really knows their stuff. That would be Eleanor. One of my friends you threw in quarantine. Well, she's no use to anyone there. We should let her out. I'll vouch for her. Agreed. I'll have Ava bring her here. I want to meet this Eleanor. I'm sure she'll be an asset to our community. The rest of those guys can contribute. If that's what it takes to get free. They're all pretty handy in a fight. That's why they're all under guard. Javi and I have to go meet some people now. See if we can't prove he's worth a damn. We're gonna take real good care of you. Okay? Send my apologies, David. I won't be able to make it. Feeling okay? Fine. I just want to keep an eye on my patient. The others know my vote is with you. Come on. Remember what I said. When we meet these guys, keep what happened to Mariana to yourself. Badger is one of my guys. And I will handle him. 